bear spotted. Bear spotted, and it is a blondie. It is a beautiful blonde bear. It just went behind the trees right over here. We've become comfortable in the September elk woods. But if we want to grow as hunters, we have to move past our comfort zone and do something completely different. And rifle hunting spring bears is about as different as you can get. in um this is the final hurrah for bear season but uh you guys follow along you're not going to want to miss this so hit the subscribe and the bell and there'll be several in this series um i hurt myself bear hunting you see my ankle compared to my other ankle so we're hoping this holds up but we got a spot in there that we're going to pack in that's uh probably about Oh, seven, eight miles. And I know yeah, I've, I've carried that. That is an old freaking mountain I house. know, I've carried that for probably 10 years, and I never opened it. <laughs> we should take it and eat it tonight. No. Chicken it's not going to hurt anything. You're uh, supposed to have, so you're supposed where's to. Where's the ex expiration date on this thing? There is, there is none. Yes, it la only lasts like 15 years. Mountain house is not, no, I've seen Jerry, he had white mountain houses. <laughs> Here, there it is. Oh, this is bad. This went bad in 2014. What? Yeah. <laughs> uh, manufactured this going with us. What is this? Oh, that's a back. There's a heavy. Oh, yeah, you need those too. <laughs> well, Wait, those red heroes and those are back. You'll, you'll be wanting to eat Granella that. with blueberries. I'll give you one of those. Okay. Uh, here's another old mountain house. What is that? Lasagna with meat sauce. Yeah. Man, I I don't think I ever bought a mountain house with that logo. That is an old, old That's logo. That's not that old. That's old. The old ones were white. 2014. Was when it was manufactured. Yeah, that's old. That's an old mountain house. I, can't I had that in my pack probably that time I killed that bull <laughs> in 14. I mean, look at, look at how different they are now. Well, I got three different ones because then you got this one too. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so see? look. There you go. <laughs> Eat your heart. Be hey, tell, tell everybody what's going on. Um, we were supposed to be here this morning. So, told Dad to meet me at 10 o'clock. No, we don't need kept, to go there. Couldn't find a sleeping bag, so about 11.30 showed up at my house. We got on the freeway. We did a whopping 40 miles per hour because the brakes were dragging. We got cars just zinging by us. So, we had to fix the brakes. Fix the brakes. That took about, I don't know, half an hour, an hour and a half, about yeah. an hour. And then, uh, so, I don't even know what time it is. It's like, it's afternoon something or yeah. other. It's, but, it's uh, time to we're, find we, we made it here. So, we're going to backpack in to a place that we have kind of been, we've been here twice. But uh, now it's time to get serious because the weather's, the weather's with us, I hope. It's getting cloudy. But I, your, your name should be Billy. Billy? Billy Bob. <laughs> with that shirt. I I only wore, I only brought this shirt, you know. I didn't bring any jackets or nothing, so we'll see what happens. You didn't bring? I brought jackets. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, <laughs> you don't want your packs lighter than mine. <laughs> Thank you, Trail Tough, for having a master cylinder. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Low Range Off Road, for having a proportion of valve. All right. So we're in a wilderness area up here in Southern Oregon. And uh, I got a bum ankle, a fairly heavy pack. What do you say, 45 pounds? Yeah. And uh, we're gonna go find us some bears. 
uh, there's known bear sightings in this area. And uh, if I'm breathing hard, it's because I'm old and fat and there's a hill. So stay tuned, you're gonna love it. Old fat guys shooting bears. You know, one thing we've never seen up in here is an elk. Yeah, this is so elky though. I know. Nope, not a bear. <laughs> they sure look like a bear. Cross country. Yeah, we're gonna, we're just gonna do a little rabbit trail to a bigger trail. Because the trail we're on parallels the trail we want to be on. But only, for, but only for a certain amount. And if you see, we don't really want to be in that. We want to be in that. That's where the bears are. First bear spotted. You guys, look. It wasn't big enough for Chase or Gage. It wasn't big enough for Gage. That, and we don't need to shoot stumps. Yeah. Yeah, we don't want to scare the big ones away. <laughs> This is when you're glad that you have a Sawyer filter. <laughs> yep. And I bet you wish you had a raincoat. I wish I brought, would have brought my raincoat, but yeah. it's all good. We got quite a bit of water. Yeah. Because so I might even make two two mountain houses tonight. You, no, you're making one peak. One peak and one mountain house. I have a peak and a granola. <laughs> Ooh, those granolas are pretty badass. Uh, the peak, the peak granola, uh, yeah. with strawberries. Oh, to die for. Ma Mountain House ain't bad either. No, Have Mountain, had Mountain House I haven't had the Mount with it's, the blueberries. Yeah, it's I haven't had it yet. Yeah, it tastes like milk and granola. Yeah. What do you say? There's two, three. Yeah. Four. What do you say? Can we eat those tonight? Cook some up. Mm-hmm. This is the morale pouch. That's morale. It's even, it's all even stiff, so it won't, it won't break nice. ice. It won't damage them. Keep your eyes out, man. We saw, oh, there's another one right there. Somewhere already ate the top of it off. Oh, yeah. Keep your eyes out. That'll go with my rice, my chicken fajitas. Heck yeah. There's still some left on him. Oh, yeah. We're having morales. It's like a double. You got a double. A double. Find us a bear. What? Find us a bear. I'm trying. Get us a bear. We need to kill him. We got a game plan. We're going to go sit on that knob, that little point knob deal right there. 
because there's you can't see it from here, but there's blades on both sides of it. So, and it they're big lights, big ones yeah. with grass like this. Yeah, we we'll probably should find a tree to get up in there. Yeah, a flat spot. Yeah. This isn't as green as I was hoping. <laughs> it's green. I mean, look at the edges. Yeah, that's true. But we found it on base map. I had to come and check it out. I've been carrying this in my pack for years. I, I didn't open the fajitas though. <laughs> okay, look at that. Ugh, that's gonna be good. That's going in this. So I got rice and chicken. Oh, look at this. This one's so new that like the little. Oh yeah, that's good. <laughs> I don't know if that's still freeze dried if that seal comes out, right? It, oh, it was already sealed above it though. That's just for cooking it. There's still chicken in there. I don't know what you're complaining about. You want, a, you want a morale? Yeah, cut me up one of them, would you? Where's Bear? We're perched up here, eating dinner. I, I'm gonna try to talk him into sleeping in the trees because... There ain't no flat spots around here. There ain't no flat spots and you don't have a pad. I got some, I got, I mean, bubble butt. Dad. Here, put the morels in there. Oh, yeah. That's gonna be so good, morels. You're waiting. This, this right here is thebomb.com. Look at this. It's so appetizing. Actually, you don't want to really look at it, but it does taste really good. All Doesn't right. sound good. I'm gonna try it. You gonna try it? Oh, we gotta get your first impression. So I've been talking this up. So I brought some for Gage. 99 cents, 99 cents. Ooh. It's good, man. Ooh. I'm telling you, it's good. Is that still good? Yes, it's still good. You gotta look, look at, what do you think? It's not bad, it's really dry. It's, it's albacore. You don't put mayonnaise in it. It's not like it's... So you're supposed to put mayonnaise in it? Well, when you have a tuna sandwich, you put mayonnaise yeah. in it. So, I would put it... I would eat this on a sandwich. It's good, huh? Is what I'm supposed to leave you? <laughs> 22? Yeah, something like that. You, you're supposed to only put 10 ounces in. Okay. So leave me 22 and then you'll have 10. There we go, right there. Okay, the rest is yours. Spotted. Bear spotted. Bear spotted, and it is a blondie. It is a beautiful blonde bear. It just went behind the trees right over here. We'll Where watch him come back out. That's, that's, that's a long 600 shot. 600 yard shot. 600? Yeah, so we'll probably have to go. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. I have to go like that way. Yeah, okay. it's a it's a blonde, beautiful well, blonde bear. Let's, let's see what he does. He might come out like right. Right, here. right. Let's let's give him some time. The wind's in our face. He's yeah. gonna be out picking around. Naked <laughs> eye. My naked eye. Yeah, I said it was a deer until I put my binoculars on it. Well, I'm glad you got your binoculars out faster than I could because I as soon as I put my binoculars, yeah, it was, it. It, was it was definitely a bear. Yeah. Really nice blondie. Really nice. So, it's not very big. I think, and the wind's perfect, it's not crazy. Yeah. It was worth our five, our six mile walk. <laughs> that, once that wind died down, they started moving. Well, it's getting later in the night too. And he might not be the only bear. Right. I want to shoot him though, because he's pretty. We could cross over and hit that rock right there. That would put you about a hundred. Oh, that rock right there? Mm-hmm. We can leave our packs here. Yeah. What's the wind doing over there? Probably the same thing it's doing here, blowing up the canyon. Yeah, but I want to know, like, 
where he, is he gonna come down here? I guess it doesn't matter if you're at that rock where he comes out at. If you're, yeah, if you're at that rock, it's not gonna matter where he comes out. If we could get there without spooking him. Yeah. Because, you know, he could see us just as well. They're not that good, but. In, in 500, 300, anywhere from 500 to 300 yards. Yeah, he's gonna be dead. Yeah. We just gotta get over there. He's in that brush right over in here. We're gonna try to sneak across. If we could get to that bluff right there, we'll kill him. But uh, I didn't get him on camera, but he's a, oh, hold on, is that him coming down? Is that, what is that, is that a log? Yeah, it's a log. I thought that might be him coming down. That would make things easy. Yeah, you just walk down here a little bit. Yeah, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna, we're leaving our packs here. So we're gonna head over, see if we can get in front of him. But it's a, it's a really, it's not a very big bear, but it's a, oh, I'm shooting him. But it's, it's a it's really pretty. cool color. So we're gonna go over there. I, I see him with the naked eye and he was a bear just the way he was walking. <laughs>
there. How does it get caught this green from? Yeah. I wonder if there's water at that seep. There could have been better there today. Right. But when you He's... see a beautiful blonde, you gotta go chase after him. Right, honey? <laughs> are, you, are you trying to catch up for your cut off sleeves? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gage said next time we just need to shoot across there to that rock over there. Just straight line. Just a bee line. Dude, it's only like 300 yards if you walk, if you go bee line. Yeah, if you just straight line it. But you go down through and up. That's a lot of miles. At least you get granola. Let's we'll see if it's soggy or not. That, that's your reward. It says to let it sit for 10 minutes. We let it sit for two hours. <laughs> that bear was just right over there. Uh, anyhow, mm. I think we're gonna we're gonna move camp down there, and then we're going to. Uh, oh, it's good. We found some flat spots down there, so we're gonna sit on the flat spots. All right camp on the flat spot because it's not really flat right here just put your stuff away uh, uh, uh. moving camp <laughs> 